Hey guys, Alex Terrace here. I have researched hydrogen cups and other hydrogen related products for at least nine years now. So let me tell you why you should spend more on this Echo Go Plus version from Echo H2O, the company formerly known as Synergy Science. Uh, if you don't know, this is a company that actually is the largest um, in the water industry uh, in terms of like specialized uh, water products, um, and hydrogen machines, things like that. People don't know that. So what does that mean? At the manufacturing level, they can uh, get special treatment, <laughs> they get special components and features that other companies do not have access to. Okay, and that's normal by the way. You find this in many product categories, certain companies bring the numbers and thus they can get exclusives. Okay, and we'll actually touch on some of those in this video. So yes, there are cups out there made by the same few factories. They make them for many different brands, but there's big differences between them. One thing to note is a lot of, um, if you look on the bottom of some of these other like cheaper cups out there, they don't have that little port. See that little port right there? What is that? Uh -huh. That means that when you actually split the water, you're not drinking hypochlorous acid or Brown's gas oxidants mixed with hydrogen, okay? With the other cups, if they don't have that venting port for the uh, singlet oxygen, that is what you're drinking, basically. So this, when you're drinking, you're just drinking pure hydrogen enriched water. Just pure hydrogen, nothing else, okay? Not HHO, not HOH. For those of you who know, those are, let's talk that's talking about different forms that hydrogen and oxygen can take together when you're doing ionization and things like that, electrolyzation of water. All right, so that's one thing. Then in the bottom here, you have, a, you have the highest grade of PEM membrane on the market. There's a water test out of Vegas in a lab. Shows nothing added to the water outside of hydrogen, okay? Um, I also know in the last couple of years, they just ditched one of the best manufacturers of PEM membranes, DuPont, um, and actually went with a newer technology that's even superior. Um, and so there's that in there. The PEM membrane, by the way, that's what just ensures that only hydrogen is making its way into your water. Your water that you're drinking here, it's not reacting with the plates and then all mixing around, as I said before, okay? So that's an important difference, once again, versus other things out there, okay? Uh, and then the other thing is the plates down here, okay? That's platinum coated onto titanium plates. Now this is where things get really different and certain companies get special access to things, okay? So they have an exclusive access to one of the current top best ways of getting platinum to bond onto titanium, okay? Cathode and anode, platinum coated, those are catalysts that actually are responsible for splitting oxygen and hydrogen out of the water, if you didn't know that. So it goes through several brushings on the titanium. They then basically use a really advanced sintering technology, uh, then go into a highly oxidizing furnace. It's a process that basically ensures that your plates are probably good for like 100,000 hours. An unfathomable amount of time, most people probably just give up drinking hydrogen water <laughs> over that period of time. It's not sticking with their routine before this thing ever, you know, that plate is not doing what it's supposed to do. Anyway, so yeah, that's about, in other words, it's pretty much permanent once that platinum is on there. So there is a very popular company that does not do that, by the way. It starts with the letter K, ends with the letter N. And they have notorious problems with oxidizing and other issues with uh, that bonding coming off their plates. That's right. Uh, and so you really got to know some of this technical side of things on the manufacturing level to really do your due diligence on products. Um, but it's a fun it's a fun backstory with that company that starts with the letter K. Let's just say. And so moving on. So the also thing to look into is the platinum coat on here is about twice the thickness of other companies, about 0.4 microns. A lot of companies do half the thickness. That affects how much hydrogen can be created. It also affects the longevity, as I talked about before. Never put well water or iron-rich water, anything high in iron. That's very damaging to the catalytic aspects of platinum. You always want to put purified water in here. 
So I just wanted to make sure you guys all know that. Um, if you have any questions, you can always email me below in the description, or I always answer comments as well. Last thing I wanted to mention is this thing splits so much and releases so much more hydrogen than any other company that when you run this thing, you hear a little squeal in the top, tiny little weird noise. Um, that's the pressure valve release, if you didn't know that. And if they didn't have that, it might sometimes be at the risk of exploding. So that's how much hydrogen is created by this thing. You can just see the bubble streaming up like crazy compared to other things. So they needed a pressure release valve basically in there. Um, and then also, if this thing is he really heavy, and by the way, and thick, all these components, this plastic is crazy thick, about the thickest you can get um, for this type of function, consumer product. Again, it needed to be very durable because of the pressures that are created in here. So do I think it's worth the $250? Absolutely. Um, this thing is kind of made like a tank. Now that you understand, there are some definitely some unique manufacturing features on here. And you can make like real medical grade, um, highly concentrated hydrogen gas, um, hydrogen rich water. So if you have any questions about this particular one, or just other hydrogen technologies out there or synergistic complementary modalities. I actually make a lot of interesting protocols. Again, just email me anytime. Always happy to educate anybody. Thanks for watching.